Yo, Jackson, what's up? This is Chris Lopez here at the Jersey Strength Pit Gym, Jackson's authority for fitness and sports performance. And in today's blog post, we are going to be covering speed training. How do we get your child faster? The first step to speed training is not what you think it is, and I guarantee it. And what I'm about to tell you is going to change how you think about speed and how your child trains for speed. And if they're not training this way, they're wasting their time. Hopefully I have your attention now. All right, so let's get right to it. When we think of speed, what is speed? What is it we do when we run? When we run, we take a step, right? We take a step and we drive that foot into the ground to help propel ourselves forward. The harder we drive, the harder we can push into the ground, the more ground we cover, the harder we run, the faster we are, okay? So what does that mean for the youth athlete? That means agility ladders, cone drills, fancy footwork, quick feet drills, is BS, and that it's, it's not superior to strength training, especially at the young athlete level. You can't train 10 and 12 year old kids like you see NFL players training for the combine. They're two totally different animals. You take these young kids, you build up the strength in their legs, you build up the, the tendon strength and the ligament strength in their bodies and allow them to be more aware of their body when they train, get that strength base, they are going to be much faster than the kids who are doing agility ladders, cone drills, footwork drills, without a doubt, okay? Because the more force you can produce from strength training, the more force you can produce and put into the ground when you run, the harder you're gonna run. And not only that, here's the best part. If your son is a football player and somebody squares up to tackle them, your son, if he's been training for strength, has an increased force production when he pushes into the ground and he's gonna run that other kid over, without a doubt, okay? So the final thought is ditch the agility ladders, ditch the cone drills, start training for strength. And once that strength base is there, then you can start doing fancier stuff. Then you can start doing medicine ball throws or fancy sprint drills, things like that. Until that strength base is there, the, child, the children should not be doing any of that stuff. Okay, just my two cents. If you want more information on our athlete development program here, please click one of the links below. We have a youth program for high school students and a youth program for middle school students, and we guarantee strength, power, and more speed than the competition. All right, guys, until next time, Chris Lopez from The Pit. Talk to you guys later.